the celebration of innovation and excellence. I would like to call upon Mr. Rahul Singh, Head of Marketing, SAP Indian Subcontinent, to share the stage with me and present the awards. Welcome to the day two of the SAP ACE Awards 2021. Yesterday, we unveiled the winners of the disruptors categories across human experience, customer experience, procurement and supply chain, finance and manufacturing. And today, we will cover the grand category of the game changers and the two new categories, the community catalyst and the sustainability champion. So without much ado, let's get on with the proceedings. The first award category for today recognizes enterprises that rose to the occasion during the pandemic by engaging in innovative and unique projects to support communities, employees, customers during the pandemic. While the past 20 months have been tough on all of us, there have been incredible examples of how people and businesses demonstrated extraordinary ingenuity and innovation to make a positive impact to the lives of people and communities around them. Did you know, Shobha, that at the peak of the pandemic, India produced 2 lakh PPE kits per day and became the world's second largest manufacturer of PPE kits. Numerous businesses, including many of our customers, modified their manufacturing capabilities to start manufacturing ventilators, hand sanitizers, medical oxygen cylinders, and many of them converted their facilities to temporary COVID care centers. In fact, a very popular dating app provider, Shobha, even offered its matchmaking algorithm to help match plasma donors with COVID patients. Wow, what an amazing display of human spirit, resilience and the incredible instinct to innovate in adversity. I'm so excited to know who the winner of the SAP ACE Community Catalyst Award is. Well, why wait? Let's find out. The first winner of the SAP ACE Community Catalyst Award is a Maharatna and a diversified, integrated energy major with presence in almost all the streams of oil, gas, petrochemicals and alternative energy sources. As an essential services provider, they had to continue serving customers and citizens even during COVID lockdowns, ensuring safety of their customers, partners and employees at that time. They are winners of the ACE for rapidly building a unique document management solution that ensured 25% reduction in manual processes and automating 50% of business transaction volumes, impacting over 50,000 customers and 31,000 employees. And the winner is Indian Oil Corporation Limited. Congratulations to their implementation partner, SAP Services. The year 2020 marked the beginning of a challenging crisis for humanity and during this healthcare emergency, the key focus for Indian Oil was to ensure uninterrupted supply of fuel to all the corners of the country to strengthen India's fight against COVID-19. Thus, there was an urgent need for Indian Oil to implement a stable and reliable solution for paperless office for keeping stakeholders safe and connected to the pandemic. We found the answer matching to our needs in SAP Open Tech Solution, which had promised uh, for a uniform and enterprise DMS for Indian Oil. ICL and SAP teams deliberated on the concerns ICL had, collaborated with various stakeholders, and implemented a common unified document management system based on SAP Open Tech Solution with seamless integration with the entire SAP application in Illinois. In close coordination and collaboration with SAP, the entire project was implemented well within the challenging target during these pandemic times. With this, IOCL could establish a stable and reliable document management system for its SAP landscape by implementing the solution, resulting in paperless automation of critical business processes and better utilization of available resources. The customer touch points and the employees of Indian Oil have benefited from the initiative due to the digitalization of many processes such as invoicing, e approvals, IT declarations, employee claims, etc. On behalf of Indian Oil Corporation Limited, I am happy to accept the SAP S Award 2021 
in the community catalyst category. All the congratulations to the entire ICL and SCP teams on winning the award. I am sure with the continued partnership with SAP, we will be able to embrace more and more innovations in creating opportunities for our business to transform and proliferate. Our collaboration continues. Thank you all. The second winner of the SAP ACE Community Catalyst Award is a state-owned engineering, hospitality and public works entity focused on developing and maintaining the modern township, new town in West Bengal and its infrastructure. During the pandemic, they undertook numerous initiatives and organized health camps and food sites for laborers, distributed free immunity boosting meds and provided senior citizens with medicines and groceries. Post the cyclone Amphan, they initiated a massive reforestation drive to revive areas that were affected the most. With SAP, they effectively leveraged on technology to simplify service requests and applications for citizens during the pandemic. And the winner is the West Bengal Housing Infrastructure Development Corporation. Congratulations to their implementation partner, PwC Limited. On behalf of HITCO, which is a government of West Bengal undertaking, I am very happy to accept and acknowledge the prize that has been awarded to it. We serve the whole city with its 62,000 people is very inclusive. We do welfare activities for the elderly people through Snehodia and Shopnubo and we have numerous children's park and business club for everybody. In this process, there are a large number of revenue centers, hospitality centers, utilities, business club. These are very difficult to reconcile and understand the performance in a holistic manner. I personally look at the holistic figures every day in the morning and see how, what was the revenue earned, what was the expenditure incurred, how did the revenue compare with last week and last month and all these help us to improve performance and therefore serve the people in a better fashion. In this endeavor, we are thankful for the digital technologies brought into us by the SAP system and of course we are assisted by the PwC and the mothers and the finance and IT team of the HITCO itself. Thank you very much. The Community Catalyst Special Jury Recognition The jury made a special mention in this category of a company that is a state and private joint venture engaged in power distribution to a population of around 1 million. The project of end-to-end -end integration of customers' complaints for supply outage that came through multiple touch points was cited as commendable as it gave customers proactive intimation on outages and expected restoration times. Besides, the ability to identify faulty electrical devices geospatially significantly reduced service times. The recipient of this special jury mention is Noida Power Company. At the outset, I would like to thank Indus, SAP and the esteemed members of the jury for recognizing this project in the Community Catalyst category. We have always taken pride in uh, providing exemplary services to our customers. So when the global pandemic presented major challenges before our customers in order to reach us, we took it upon ourselves to find a solution. Because of the popularity of WhatsApp as a messaging medium amongst our customers, we chose it to integrate with SAP ECC and CRM systems to ensure easy and seamless communication with the customers. The integration of SAP with WhatsApp was uh, taken up and uh, implemented by our own in-house team. And it was led by Rohit Shukla with excellent contributions from Afzal Rizvi, Ankama Marku, Ajay Gulati, Gaurav Sharma, Rajiv Srivastav, 
and Srishti Prakash. It is indeed a special moment for our organization to be recognized by the jury of SAP ACE Awards in consecutive years. And with uh, the transition to SAP S4 HANA approaching, we will very soon be well placed to provide a truly digital experience to our stakeholders in the times to come. Thank you. Shobha, over the next decade, India will witness unprecedented growth which will come on the back of a massive increase in economic activity. Needless to mention that the environmental impact of this growth would be catastrophic. India is already the third largest CO2 emitter in the world and its energy demand is likely to double by 2040. On the other hand, customers, potential investors and potential employees are already beginning to differentiate between brands and business partners on the basis of their sustainability business practices. Hence, sustainability is becoming a strategic value creator for the business rather than being a mere cost element on the P&L statement. We have introduced the SAP ACE Sustainability Champion Award this year with a view to recognize businesses that are already embedding sustainability in their business models through carbon footprint reduction, ethical and inclusive supply chains, etc. Rahul, I truly believe that climate action and sustainable and inclusive growth is the single most important human mission of this century. I'm looking forward to finding out who the winner is in this very important category. Well, why wait? Let's find out. The winner of this award is one of India's leading real estate developing companies with a legacy of over six decades. They are adjudged winners in this category for embedding sustainability practices across all their projects from inception with a strong focus on clean energy, recycling and leveraging smart innovative technologies to deliver net zero concept buildings. And the recipient of the Sustainability Champion Award is K. Raheja Kaur. My name is Shabir Kachwala from K. Raheja Corp and I would like to thank SAP for having honored us with the Sustainable Champion Awards. Uh, sustainability is part of our, of our ethos right from 2007 when we started building uh, sustainable buildings across the, the west and south of the country. So whether it is a green IT office or a green home or a green hotel, that's, that is what we have been doing. I would also like to thank my management and my team members who have been an instrumental in this journey towards sustainability. Thank you. The final category of this year's SAP ACE is the Game Changers, which aims to identify companies that are on long-term transformation journeys covering multiple lines of businesses. Well, digital transformation is a key component of an overall business transformation strategy. And while not the only factor, it is critical to the success or failure of any transformation effort. The right technologies coupled with people, processes and operations give organizations the ability to adapt quickly to disruptions and opportunities, meet new and evolving customer needs and drive future growth and innovation, often in unexpected ways. Rahul, in its uh, latest survey of senior business executives, McKinsey found that since the pandemic, there's a palpable sense of urgency among business leaders to digitalize and modernize their processes and legacy systems. Most respondents recognize that their company's business models have become obsolete. Only 11% believe their current business models will be economically viable through 2023, while another 64% say their companies need to build new digital businesses to help them get there. Well, for today's businesses, it is no longer a matter of if they need digitalization to compete in the current business climate, but how soon they can get started on their digital transformation journey. For the Game Changers category, we received over 50 nominations from across industries and businesses of all sizes, 
Needless to mention that it was a very, very difficult category for the jury to decide given the quality of nominations. Well, Shobha, let's try and find out who the winners of this category are. Oh, absolutely. Let's find out. The first winner of the SAP Ace Game Changer Award in Large Enterprise is one of India's largest infrastructure developers engaged in development of roads, bridges, metro rails, ports and power transmission lines. This company deserves Ace for its Big Bang implementation of SAP S4 HANA for 14 entities with 16 plus SAP modules and several third-party applications. This massive integrated implementation is the first of its kind in the Indian infrastructure industry and is already making significant business impact in the areas of procurement and inventory, operations and maintenance and finance. And the winner is LNT Infrastructure Development Project Limited. Congratulations to their project partners, LNT Infotech, Sartha Labs, and EIM Solutions. Right. I'm along with the team, is really thrilled and excited to receive the prestigious SAP S Award for Project Fusion. This is a reward for the hard work, commitment, innovative thinking, future planning and dedication of the entire business teams, partners and long term vision of the management. I dedicate this award to all of them, including the family members and the management team. Project Fusion is a greenfield project implemented in a Big Bang approach for 14 companies, two business units with 16 plus SAP modules and interfacing with multiple third party systems. This award truly reflects the effort and the organization intent. Be the market leader and first mover in implementing latest future technologies, equipment, tools and lead by example in our industry. I request Mr. Sanjay Tiku to share his experience. Hello everybody. It undoubtedly makes us at LNT IDPL extremely happy to back such a prestigious award. In fact, during the implementation of the project, we always believed that we were onto something extraordinary. And uh, that is probably because of the complexity of the project, the shared size of the project, and the fact that Corona came on the scene while we were grappling with the difficulties of the project. Uh, a, a, an award like this from none other than SAP themselves is a confirmation of our beliefs. And I don't think one can ask for more. I'm sure my excitement is shared by the team. Go to the team. The second winner of the SAP Ace Game Changer Award in Large Enterprise is part of one of India's most respected and diversified conglomerates and is a leading player in the branded retail industry, operating over 170 stores across 90 cities. They are the winners of the ACE in this category for their single-step implementation of SAP S4 Retail Merchandise Management on HANA Enterprise Cloud. The project has truly unlocked the potential of their IT landscape, providing them a digital core for all their future digital-first technologies. And the winner is Trent Limited. Congratulations to their project partner, Tata Consultancy Services. We would like to thank Indus and SAB for selecting Trent for this award. It is an honor and pleasure to accept this SABS award on behalf of the Trent team who implemented this project and achieved the desired result for the organization. We would also want to thank our implementation partner, TCS, and the SAP Active Attention Services team, without whom this project would not have been possible. SAP S4 HANA is a significant milestone in the growth strategy for Trent. It has not only increased the overall efficiency of the system, but has also become a digital core for all future digital first technologies. Movement to HANA Enterprise Cloud has further strengthened the infrastructure with elasticity and flexibility of the cloud on demand behavior. Finally, a big thank you to the Trend Management team for their sponsorship, guidance, and commitment for this project. Next up, is a special SAP recognition in this category 
for one of the largest urban local bodies in Asia that manages an area of over 480 square kilometers and provides services to more than 10 million citizens. They are the recipient of this recognition for their implementation of SAP S4 HANA, which gave them a robust digital core to build a comprehensive citizen engagement platform and systems for effective planning and budgeting across all departments and integration of GIS for effective real estate management. The recipient of this special SAP recognition is Municipal Corporation of Greater Mumbai. Congratulations to their project partners, Entity Data and PwC Limited. The next award is the Game Changer Award at Midsize Enterprises and the winner is a New Age Renewable Energy Platform that currently manages 395 megawatts of solar assets located in the states of Maharashtra, Gujarat, Rajasthan, Uttar Pradesh and Tamil Nadu. They are the winners of the ACE in this segment for their comprehensive rise with SAP implementation that involved SAP S4 HANA Private Cloud Edition, SAP Business Process Consolidation and SAP Cloud Platform Integrations. The project is already demonstrating outcomes in the form of 100% standardization and adoption of best practices across 11 legal entities, 2x improvement in productivity and 100% improvement in reporting including consolidation. And the winner is Recent Infrastructure. Congratulations to their project partner, IBM India Private Limited. Hello everyone. Virsin Infrastructure was born in pandemic and it's a moment of pride and honor that in very short time, we have acquired nine companies having 14 plants across five estates in India. Set up entire IT architecture from scratch. We also set up India's first renewable energy infrastructure investment trust in WIT and most importantly laid a robust foundation by implementing SAP S4 HANA private collaboration to support our inorganic growth by merging and acquisition. We are a digital first, cloud first and SaaS first organization and after detailed evaluation and deliberation we selected SAP private collaboration. We started this Greenfield implementation project in December 2020 and went live with 11 companies in July 2021. We successfully implemented SAP S4 HANA along with SAP Business Planning and Consolidation and SAP Cloud Platform Integration. We are also using SAP Fury extensively. In new normal way of working, entire project was implemented remotely. This project gave us more flexible operational environment and helped us to standardize and automate processes and integrate multiple functions seamlessly. I would like to thank SAP ACE Awards team for recognizing our efforts. Also, I want to thank Indus team, SAP team, jury members, our implementation partner IBM, our CEO Mr. Sanjay Grewal and Mr. Suman from KKR. I dedicate this award to our project core team. Once again, thank you all. The second Game Changer Award winner in Midsize Enterprises is the pioneer of synthetic leather manufacturing in Sri Lanka with state-of-the-art production facilities. They are manufacturers of a range of vinyl flooring, sheeting, synthetic leather and related products. They are the winners of the ACE for their implementation of SAP Business One HANA on cloud, an integrated solution covering finance, purchasing, inventory, manufacturing, sales and service also gave them the ability to serve customers much faster with mobile apps, alerts and approvals on the go. The project has shown encouraging outcomes such as 5 to 10% reduction in manufacturing costs and 10% incremental revenue from new business lines. And the winner is Global Vinyl Private Limited. Congratulations to their project partner, Perfect Business Solutions Services Private Limited. Hello everyone. It is an absolute honor and privilege to accept this award on behalf of Team Global Vinyl. I'd like to express our gratitude to Indus Annual Virtual Conclave, which is 
hosting the SAPS Awards this evening and awarding us under the Game Changer category. Global Vinyl is the market leader and pioneer of vinyl flooring manufacturing in Sri Lanka. We count over 40 years of unparalleled experience. We set off to um, look for a new ERP system due to the limitation of our existing system, which is uh, in-house built. And subsequently, we, after an extensive search, we are narrowed it down to um, SAP Business One HANA platform. Um, it's a world-renowned platform uh, with a feature-rich set of uh, features. It also um, helped us minimize the implementation time and rollout, which was a key decision factors. Um, our significant challenges were we rolled out, uh, we had struck during the first COVID lockdown, which uh, where bulk of the implementation really happened. So 80% was done remotely. We had a lot of challenges, um, but our, with the help of our partners, we had managed to have it rolled out by the end. Um, the, I would also like to thank our partners, uh, the Gold Partners, uh, Perfect Business Solution uh, Services for their extensive support in uh, system implementation and rollout and afterwards. Uh, it's, this wouldn't be possible without them, so I would like to also express my gratitude and thanks to them. And we are now uh, using the ERP solutions end to end and we are all um, happy about it. Thank you very much. Game Changer Special Jury Recognition In this category, jury found a nomination worthy of a very special mention. It is India's premier institute for advanced scientific and technological research and education that has been in existence for over 111 years. They receive this recognition for setting new benchmarks in the education sector with their successful implementation of SAP S4 HANA across all its departments and functions. And the recipient of this special jury mention is Indian Institute of Science, Bangalore. Congratulations to their project partner, Wipro Limited. I'm Professor Anil Kumar a professor in physics and chair the Kids Indian Institute of Science. We are glad to acknowledge the successful nomination of Indian Institute of Science for the SAP ACE 2021 award in the Game Changer category for the successful implementation of SAP S4 HANA ERP project. This is a joint venture of IAC, Wipro, SAP and Controllers. This project has been implemented in two ways. In wave one, finance, HR and payroll, sourcing and procurement for stores and purchase are implemented and went live on June 3rd, 2019. Wave two includes student life cycle management for academics, hostel and mess management, etc., and went live on January 8th, 2021. The transition from the legacy systems to the SAP ERP system has posed many issues and challenges the end users. These issues and challenges are typical of any ERP implementation. The digits team, the faculty members, the students, the administrative team and the Wipro team have systematically addressed the issues. At this time, I would like to thank former director of IAC, Professor Andhra Kumar and the present director, Professor Govindan Nagarajan for their leadership and support. The tireless efforts of former chair of Digits, Professor Narahari, the deans, the faculty members, the students, the administrative officer, officers and staff, Mr. Amit Chakravarti, the I-STAR core support team, the registrar, the financial controller, the Wipro team, the SAP team, and the controllers team also needs to be placed on record. Special jury recognition. In this category, jury found a nomination worthy of a very special mention. It is India's premier institute for advanced scientific and technological research and education that has been in existence for over 111 years. They receive this recognition for setting new benchmarks in the education sector with their successful implementation of SAP S4 HANA across all its departments and functions. And the recipient of this special jury mention is Indian Institute of Science, Bangalore. Congratulations to their project partner, 
Wipro Limited. I'm Professor Anil Kumar, a professor in physics and chair physics in the Ministry of Science. We are glad to acknowledge the successful nomination of Indian Institute of Science for the SAP ACE 2021 award in the Game Changer category for the successful implementation of SAP S4 HANA ERP project. This is a joint venture of IAC, Wipro, SAP, and Controllers. This project has been implemented in two ways. In wave one, finance, HR, and payroll, sourcing and procurement for stores and purchase are implemented and went live on June 3rd, 2019. Wave two includes student life cycle management for academics, hostel and mess management, etc., and went live on January 8, 2021. The transition from the legacy systems to the SAP ERP system has posed many issues and challenges to the end users. These issues and challenges are typical of any ERP implementation. The digits team, the faculty members, the students, the administrative team and the Wipro team have systematically addressed the issues. At this time, I would like to thank former director of IAC, Prof. Andhra Kumar, and the present director, Prof. Govindan Nagarajan, for their leadership and support. The tireless efforts of former chair of digits, Prof. Narahari, the deans, the faculty members, the students, the administrative officer, officers and staff, Mr. Amit Chakravarti, the ISTAR core support team, the registrar, the financial controller, the Wipro team, the SAP team, and the controllers team also needs to be placed on record. Well, no amount of applause is enough for the winners of this category. Many congratulations to the entire winning organization. Well, that, ladies and gentlemen, brings us to the end of SAP ACE 2021. It was a unique challenge producing this program and bringing it to you virtually, but we thoroughly enjoyed the process, which has now become a part of, let's say, the new normal. And on behalf of SAP and Indus, we would like to thank each and every company who filed a nomination for the awards this year, and we hope to see your continued participation in the future. And we earnestly hope to bring this event live in a physical format next time. Here's wishing you and your loved ones the very best of everything. Looking forward to seeing you again in 2022. Stay safe and take care everybody.